Hey guys, so it's Hans Munch here, and sorry I haven't uploaded in a really long time. I have been really busy. Obviously, as you can see in the corner, Muffin has got turning cage, so um, I'll explain a bit more about that in a moment. So I've decided to do this thing where once a month I upload like all the haul or what I've bought for Muffin um, that month. So that's what I'm obviously going to be uploading. Um, the package opening of like when when I open the cage of Muffin that should be uploaded soon. However, the one of me assembling it is like over thirty minutes long, but that has not been edited yet. Um, so I'm not sure what to do because it won't let me edit because it's so long so I'll have to try and get my brother to edit that um, and Muffin's new cage that she's in there should be a cage tour very soon so fingers crossed that comes soon um, and also Kigio Bieber has up um, uploaded her video of what I've got her so links to that will be down in the description um, so the first clip that you'll see right now is of when I went to Pets at Home. Hey guys, it's Hans Munch and today I went to Pets at Home as you can see by the packaging in front of me. Um, so the grand total for everything that I got was £12.50 um, which is a bit expensive for what I have got. Um, so yeah, let's get started. Okay, so um, this is what the front looks like, um, and this was the medium wood shavings, and it looks like this. And then um, the back lo looks like this. Okay, so these medium wood shavings were four fa four pound fifty. Just for this, um, um, how much is it? I'm not sure, I'll just check now. Okay, so it doesn't actually say um, how much there is in it, but it's that big. Like, my hand is now on it, and it's quite big, and I use about a couple of handfuls every time I change Muffin's bedding. Um, and, yeah, um, so that was £4.50 from Pets at Home. Okay, so the next thing I got was these Woodlands Willow Sticks. And it says Natural Goodness for Furry Friends. Um, and it's suitable for um, rabbits, guinea pigs, chinchillas and ferrets. Um, and they're uh, perfectly safe for muffin too. So I've done a lot of research on this. And then here's what it just says. So yeah, um, and these willow sticks were three pound. Um, so I didn't think that I was bad. So that's what those look like. And then the next thing that I picked up was again from the woodland section, and this was a stuffed wood roll. Um, and this was two pounds, which I thought was pretty cheap, according to how big it is. Um, and it has some stuffed treats for Muffin in here, here, and here. And it also tells me the date when this one's out. And then here it has some compositions and stuff like that. Okay, so that's what it looks like. And this will be going in... Um, Muffin's new cage that I'm buying her because I'm actually buying Muffin a new cage because I do think that the one that she's in is just a tiny bit too small so I'm going to treat her to a new stuffed log and um, when she gets her new cage which should be arriving in a couple of weeks okay so the final three things that I got for Muffin were a pound each and they should have been dearer than that um, but it's, it said there was like, uh, I think they were like £1.50 or £2 if I got them separately, but there was an offer three for £3, so I just decided to pick up different ones. So the first one that I got was this Woodland Rabbit Shaped Strawberry Treat, um, 
and it's like a ready orange and some seeds. Here's the back. Um, if you want to read that, and it also has the best before date, um, which is the first of December. And then I'm not sure what this is called because it I think I've lost the sticker, but it must be an apple thing because um, it's got green in it. And then she also has um, the back for it. And it also says the best before date. Um, and then finally, um, I got a muffin or honey heart snack shape treat and then it also says what it's like for it says the grams and then this one is like a tiny bit of green as well and then here's the back and it also says the date date will run out so it's the first of january 2015 so yeah okay so these were all the things that i got for muffin and like i said at the beginning this came up to 12 pound 50 and i'm just going to do a quick um, swipe over of what I got. Okay, so that's what I got. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe if you already haven't. Um, and don't forget to um, leave down what you would like to the next video to be and maybe um, I can do that if it's in my section so yeah bye okay so the clip that you've just seen is of me when I went to Pets at Home and that was earlier this month and um, so yeah so the first thing the first thing where I went was to the welcome pet shop and that is um, near my um, hat well not near it but it's like mile drive or something two to three miles away from me and I was actually really surprised um, and I'm not sure what this came to me um, but like all the prices will be down in the description if I forget to tell you any so the first thing I bought was this hedgehog little chew and I bought this because Muffin really loves the bump so this was I've shown you four items from the pet the welcome pet shop and this was one pound sixty if I remember correctly um and it's really cute um and I'm waiting for muffin to finish her other antos chew so this is an antos dog chew but it's fine for hamsters and the next thing that I got was these boredom breaker play veg and I was like so excited when I see saw these I was like I need to buy them because I wanted to order some offline but my mum said I couldn't because there was something like wrong with like her credit card and she said that I couldn't because it would get sent into town like the trade package and this was £2.75 yeah and this came in six so I immediately put one in Muffin's cage and as she does with all of her chews, she always has like a nibble on one. So yeah. And then the next thing that I was like really excited about because I cannot find them anywhere in the UK because they are um, like overbroad. They're like from the USA or Canada. I got these music um, chews and the woman said she doesn't actually know where she got these from. Because I wasn't sure where she was from, but she was selling hamsters, and I really wanted to buy one, but my mum wouldn't let me because my my room isn't that big. Um, but like everything's happening, that's why you can't see the floor because it's literally a mess. Because I'm getting new cupboards. So here is a mobile and uh, MP3 player, um, and then this one. This is like the pack that I really wanted. It has a piano, like a guitar. I think and a trumpet and I play one of these um so well I call them cornets because I play a cornet so yeah I got these four um from the welcome pet shop so all the prices will be down in the description if you want to know any more so the next thing I went to was um world of water and this is also quite near me, it's like a couple of miles away 
um, and so is pets at home. Um, so I was like, because I help my granddad in the garden, I help pick, dig up the potatoes and the peas, and I load mowed his grass. And yeah, and it took it's been like over two days, three days wages pay. So yeah, so this is what I got. So I was really excited, and I couldn't go that far because um over with him but it came to um eleven pound ninety four I think it was. I actually have a receipt so <laughs> okay so this came up to eleven pound ninety six so it's two P out and my granddad just about paid for it because he said that I could have some like a couple of items so, first of all, I went for the corn rattle rollers, and it says small small animals, especially rabbits, love to flip, toss, and chew toys made of corn, wood, and sizzle. Such toys can enchant your best friend's um, time in their cage, as with such toys, remove and replace it if it becomes excessively damaged. Um, and... Um, this is for small animals, and there's the back. Um, so this was two ninety nine, and then the next thing that I picked up, and I really, I've really been wanting these, was this Borden Breaker cor Corny the Owl, and I think this is so cute. Here's the back. I think this is really cute, and I kind of like the idea of this being in Muffin's cage because then she has like a friend. Like, I know that seems bad, but she doesn't have, like, many. So, like, this can be a friend as well. <laughs> um, and you can read that out because it's really... Well, you can't read it out, but you can read it because it is really long. So, I, I thought I would pick this up, and this is £2.49. And then the next thing that I picked up was this board and Breaker Play and Climb. Um, and there's the back. And I got because I made it in the car because I'm so excited to get it. It looks like this. Um, I thought it was going to be a tiny bit bigger, but it doesn't matter because I know Muffin will still flip through it and she will still love it. Um, so, this was £2.99 or £2 for £5. No, 2 for £5. And um, my granddad didn't have that much money. I would pick an, up another one. I nearly bought some more hamsters. Again, like I always do. Um, I really want another hamster, if you cannot tell. Um, but, yeah, that's what the package looks like. And the last thing that I've really been wanting to have, like, forever, um, is, like, some more bathing sand for Muffin, because um, I'll explain it in her cage tour. Well, I won't, because it will gone, be gone, but I'll just show you what I've done with, like, the Muffin's cage. Okay, so um, this is Muffin's like little sand bath, and if it doesn't come out, it needs to. I cannot show you, but it's like this really grind down little like thingy, and that was actually meant to be for um, the like poop thingy, but she has started to poop in, um, which I don't mind taking out. Um, but this was meant to be in it, and this actually does have a dome across it. And straight away when I realised it, Muffin was actually rolling around in it. So just because this was used to be a food bowl. But I use this now as her food. As you can see here, that's her food bowl. And then this needs to be cleaned out. And um, that was like the litter that came in it. But because I didn't want to waste it, Muffin rolled around in it, I just decided to swap them around. And I think this is, will be quite permanent because Muffin loves sitting in this and eating. So, what I got, sorry about that. What I got was this bathing sand. And this says, um, for chinchillas, hamsters, gerbils and dagoos, 100% natural sand, dust free, suitable for chinchillas, hamsters, gerbils and dagoos. Free of bacteria, naturally absorbent, for ma maintaining ideal coat condition of show chinchillas. So, this is, um, like, bathing sand, and I've really been wanting to pick these up. 
in fact, when I went to go and pick, pick these up at Pets at Home, they did not have them because they changed them until dust. And I was like, um, Muffin can't have dust because it's bad for the respiratory system, if I can say that. Um, so I was really glad when this got picked up. And this was £3.49, which I didn't think was quite bad as it would last me like a really long time, I think. Um, because this, it came in like a little pack, it was about, like, that big. And this has lasted Muffin over three weeks, um, maybe four weeks, because I don't actually clean her cage out that often, because um, she wees in a penthouse and um, she doesn't wee or poo downstairs, she always does it in a penthouse, so I just clean that out every single day. Um, and she doesn't actually poo down in the bottom, so it like literally doesn't smell but I think every like three weeks or two weeks or um every month I will clean her out and it's nearly due for cleaning for her um because it's nearly getting to four weeks um that sounds bad because I haven't uploaded in that long um the contest winner should be out soon I just need to like look over them again so make sure to get your entries in um, and that will be it, so I'll just do a quick overview of what I've got today. Well, over a couple of, over a month. I've got these Play Veg, these two Super Pet Music Chews. Um, this Antos Dog Chew. Um, some, these Corn Rattle Rollers that have like some inside, which I'm intrigued to see what they are. Um, these Boredom Break this board and breaker Connie the Owl um, and um, this board and breaker little cli play and climb and then the last thing that I got was this bathing sand and obviously there is the pets at home one so I really hope you enjoyed this um, can't wait to upload again because I've been really busy lately literally um, so thank you again bye